Hey, church family. Hope everyone's doing all right this week. Hope you guys are getting your homework done this week. Don't skip out on it. Uh, <laughs> sorry. Uh, but I hope you guys are having a great time. Uh, just, uh, you know, enjoying some time away from school. I always dreamt of having that. And you guys are the lucky ones being able to do that. Uh, anyway, uh, this is our first uh, video in our apologetic series that we're going to do every Wednesday uh, for the foreseeable future. Just want to kind of give you guys, um, you know, uh, something uh, something to grab a hold of during this uncertain time. Certainty in this uncertain times. That's what I wanted to say. Uh, but anyway, just real quick before we hop into that, just have a couple of quick announcements. Tomorrow I'm going to do a Zoom uh, group chat with you guys. Uh, if you guys are interested in being a part of that, I'd love to have you guys be a part of that. You can get your phone. You can download the app. I'll send out a link, and we'll just get together and just chat amongst one another. Just be able to connect with one another, even though we can't get into a group of, you know, more than 10. Uh, we still want to try to connect with you guys. Uh, so tomorrow, uh, I'll send out a message letting you guys know what time, and we'll grab, uh, get on there, and we'll just hang out and just have a good time tomorrow. Uh, also, tell others about these videos. Uh, we're having fun uh, making these videos. Deanna said that we want, uh, she wants to do more videos like this with me. So, you know, because I'm that awesome. No, I'm playing. Uh, so please uh, share these videos with your friends, uh, family. It'll be a great time. Uh, just connect with one another about uh, Christian. Uh, apologetics. So, uh, apologetics. What is apologetics? Apologetics simply means to give a defense. And is the most broadest term, it just means to give a defense. And we get this uh, from Scripture, actually. It's found in 1 Peter 15, which says, But in your heart... 315. 315. 315. Sorry. Uh, thank you. Uh, it says, But in your hearts, honor Christ the Lord as holy, always being prepared to make a defense to anyone who asks you for a reason for the hope that is in you, yet do it with gentleness and respect. All right, that's where we get that uh, get apologetics from is that scripture right there. And uh, beautiful, tell us what is a Christian apologetics? Christian apologetics is the branch of Christian theology that seeks to provide a rational justification for Christian truth claims. Christian truth claims are things like um, God exists and he created the world. Uh, also, like Jesus died for our sins and that he's the son of God. Yeah, and that Jesus rose from the dead. These are uh, typical Christian truth claims. Uh, but there are goals for apologetics. Goals such as to show unbelievers the truth of the Christian worldview. Which combats unbelief like atheism and also heresy like Mormonism. Also, it confirms the Christian faith uh, to believers. Which emboldens and strengthens um, believers in their faith. Also, by the way, if you see us looking this way, we have notes over here. And we're just trying to make sure we go down them and we say everything correctly. Because uh, we can mess up. Uh, but we don't want to with this. Uh, another goal, one last goal for Christian apologetics is that it reveals and explores the connections between the Christian doctrine and other truths. Which develops and broadens the understanding of Christianity as a worldview. So Christian apologetics is a very broad, uh, you know, thing that Christian needs uh, a Christian needs in their life uh, to help not only strengthen their own faith, but, you know, help them connect with others. And the most important part I want to really state just real quickly before we exit out is towards the end of that verse he says that is uh you know good for anyone to make a defense for a reason in the for the hope that is in you but yet we need to do this with gentleness and respect you know there are some who are atheists there are some who are mormons if that is what they claim and they're not willing to change we're not here to just argue that's not what apologetics mm -hmm. is for is to you know I'm right, you're wrong, and anything like that. No, we're supposed to do this with gentleness and respect. We're wanting to convey what we believe is the truth, what we believe stands the test of time uh, as Christian truth claims, and we want to just argue for these facts. We want to give defenses. We want to give, uh, you know, make state, uh, make you know, 
truth claims about you know everything that we believe in so please don't use this as a way of like haha i get to argue with that person who doesn't believe in god no that's not what we're here for uh, but we do want to equip you guys we want to encourage you guys in your own uh walk with christ and so starting next week we're going to actually dive into areas that you know Christians need to have a defense in, and so next week we're going to uh, take a look at how we, how we can know that the Bible, you know, this book right here, you know, how we can know that this is truth, and also that it is the Word of God. That's what we're, we're going to do that next week. Uh, we're going to have some fun times. Me and Deanna love apologetics, uh, so we can't wait to keep doing these videos with you guys. We love you guys. We miss you guys. Hope you guys are staying safe out there. If you have any prayer requests or anything you want to just chat about, leave it in the comment section below. Make sure to go tell others. Share this with others. Tell them to go subscribe to us and hit the notif uh, notification bell so that they're getting the, day, uh, the weekly uh, updates on when we upload videos. All right. Do you have anything else you want to add? No. All right. Hey, I'm Chris. I'm Deanna. And we love you guys. Talk to you guys later. Bye. Bye.